What up, everybody? Oh, oh Frap just day, Kalu Kale. Y'all here for some motherfucking DBZA. I don't know what that oh. means. <laughs> po I've been po working poetry. On that. Working, yeah, yeah, on that. working on that shit. Working on that shit. How's it going, everybody? Welcome to Stream Four Star. Hi, guys. I know. Whoop! Already dr starting off with a bit. Oh, yeah, look at them bit drops. Man, right out the gate. Popping off. Ah, <sighs> good to be here, Kaiser. You're uh. You're free, momentarily speaking. Yeah, uh, for a moment. Now I don't have to do anything after the stream or tomorrow. Sunday, though, I have to move to my new apartment. So. <laughs> and Monday morning, back to work! Yep. <laughs> back in the mines. But yeah, episode's finished. I, uh, I literally put in the final line for one... It was one line I'd been waiting for. I'm not going to name the character. I was just waiting for one single line. They only have one line in the episode. Okay, so listen for a character <laughs> with only one line. <laughs> and, uh, there are two yeah. of them. Ah. Wait, three of them. There are three people with only one line. See if you can guess. Yeah. <laughs> which one he was waiting on. And uh, I got it What's put it? in last night, four something in the morning. Yeah, he did. Uh, and then <laughs> oh, I still, the line. I, I, Submit! <laughs> I still have some stuff to finish up today, but it is done. It is good. It has been run past many people on the team, and they, you know, it is... So this is one of our longer ones, too. Yeah, it is 15 minutes long. Um, maybe like 1440 if you take out the opening and the annotations. The episode is longer than the amount of time we have until the episode premieres? Wow. So think about it. Wild. Now the amount of time you are waiting, you will be watching for longer than that. Wow. That's amazing. So if this feels really long, the episode should feel longer? In theory. No, it actually <laughs> should still feel shorter because you're having fun oh, while you're watching Oh, you're having a great time. Uh, so just so you know how it's going to work is we're going to uh, air the episode at 6 o'clock <gasps> central time as we, uh... As we stated, yeah, look, boom, big ol' clock, <laughs> I'll hold it up. <laughs> there oh, you I go. love it. Yep. There we go. Oh, there it's you so go. heavy. Oh, I, oh, I hope this doesn't turn into an 11. I'm going to drop it. <laughs> I'm going to flip these seconds as they're going. Don't worry. There we go. I got, I got the one. I got the one. It's okay. I got the two. <laughs> whoop, whoop. There we go. Balancing it on my whoop. finger. There we go. I got the weight of the world on my hands, folks. Yes. Got the worry not. world <laughs> in his hands. Yes, in exactly 12 minutes and 35, 34, at least at my count. Yeah. I like we Kaiser's will be getting bears. <laughs> Kaiser's bears. Ka yeah, you and Grant. Oh. You Aww. and Grant are my bears. Oh, okay. We're thank bears you. now. <laughs> Kaiser, and the, Kaiser and the bears. <laughs> that, that would be the band name. Okay, okay. Now, which one's too hot and which one's just right? <laughs> <laughs> well, obviously, gonna, HBI give... is just right. Yeah, he oh, yeah. is. Because I'm too cold. <laughs> I'm the- I'm this, cold. this sofa's too stiff. This co- first of all- SUBMIT! <laughs> Thank you. I got you. This porridge is too... boring. Oh, yeah, good, I still got the 11. <laughs> I can still I was, hold it. I was waiting. I, I, can, I can still balance this entire time on my finger. Ah. <sighs> Numbers. Good to be here, though. Good to be here. Good to have another episode. In the book, is basically. There, is there any fun, like, cryptic thing you can say before the people see it to uh, get them all excited? Um, this, uh, gosh. You know what? I, I will say this uh, This episode is a little, uh, like, front-loaded. Okay. Um, like, a lot of the big stuff happens in the front. Uh, but it parties in the back. <laughs> oh, it's a mullet of an episode. Shoot, okay. That was... All right, I thought it... Ah! 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 <laughs> Space and time are bending to, yeah, to uh, heads well. as, as I was saying a little bit ago, Bend. the way this is going to work is uh, we'll premiere the episode uh, at six o'clock, as we stated. Then we'll mm -hmm. do an uh, like a half hour of Q and A, and then re-premiere the episode again. An uh, encore presentation. Yeah, an encore presentation of the episode at about six thirty, just for people who arrive late. Make sure they get a look at it. And after that, it should go up on YouTube shortly thereafter, I think at like 7 or 8, something like that. Yeah. And don't worry, when the episode goes live, we will shut the fuck up. So you Yeah, we will, we will not be talking over the episode. This is not an episode commentary. Yeah. No. Yeah. We might do that in the future. I was going to say, not saying that, that won't not happen someday. this. Yeah. I don't, I don't think it's any mystery of saying that we'd love to do a marathon someday. Absolutely. So we got some some bit drops while we've been waiting. We got probably not a mirror with a thousand bits. Says shout out to the other couch. We got five hundred <laughs> bits from Riotated saying, "I assume you're going to play the episode on the blue wall behind you, and the couch is going to act out all the fighting." <laughs> also a fun Man, idea. Man, that'd be hard say, with, that... with all the cuts. Yeah. yeah. 
Maybe not for the premiere, but... <laughs> yeah, directly after the second premiere, we will be going into uh, a little bit of uh, Jackbox jacking <sighs> off, and we will be playing with the crowd. So for those of you who want to play some Jackbox with Get us, excited. feel free to stick around after the re-premiere. The re-encore. Roncore. <laughs> hardcore Roncore. The Rancor. The Rancor. So stick around for the Rancor. Yeah, stick around for the Rancor, and we can and you can jack us off with some Jackbox. Yay! Never uh, yes, L E W D. Let's go. I've always Never wanted to jerk right off a Rancor. <laughs> well, right now American Hellfire is. Uh... <laughs> Maybe. You think it's as tall as a human? <laughs> that right, ratchet Rancor. No, we're, cu we're cutting off the Big Ben. Uh, it's all good. It's all good. I just wanted to thank American Hellfire for the thousand bits for the big giant head. The, <laughs> the big giant head accepts your gratitude. <laughs> big Ben. By the way, a name I, I, I approve of, too. <laughs> Just a fucking clock, guys. Get over it. <laughs> <laughs> and Setsuri with a thousand just says, new episode hype. We are all hype. We are, in if, fact, uh, that, that if, thing. <laughs> if any of us seem slightly less than hype, it's because of how hard he's been working. <laughs> it's because of how hype we've been. Hard, so hardest, hardest working man in showbiz. Scott Frerichs. Where's Masako? Like I said, Big Ben's just a fucking clock. You England. <laughs> he is in England. Masako lives <laughs> in England. <laughs> you mean you guys don't fly him over an ocean every time an episode comes out? You know, if we had the money, I still wouldn't. <laughs> <laughs> Boom! That's Shot! A, Come shot get us, fire. Masako! Because <laughs> that's a lot of booze. <laughs> Buy a lot of hookers with that money. I'm kidding. We love you, Masako. <laughs> We want you over here more often. <laughs> uh, I, yeah, if I if I do seem like I'm low energy, again, I was up until 4.30 putting that last line in, and then I had to get up. Like, I got to sleep at 6, got up at noon because I had to go shop for a new mattress. Not to mention we're all still kind of tired from moving over to this space, yeah, too. Yeah, we have kind of... And you got to meet the... Uh, you you had moving. to move away from your old possum and you met your new possum. Yes, a new possum! <laughs> I, it's amazing. I think there are just a lot of possums in this area, but the interesting thing is it's also another adolescent pot... Uh, uh, pot uh, a pot a, pos <laughs> a possum, just like the last one. The last name was named Marley. This one's name is Bailey. And she she is my friend. She hangs out with me while I edit. I introduce you leave myself. food outside. No, 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 no. no. <laughs> um, I part of me wanted to grab something small and, and and toss it to them, but I didn't want to spook it or make it come back for food because you just don't do that with wild animals. But yes, Bailey is my favorite possum, and I introduced myself last night, and she just kind of looked over at me. I looked at her, and then she just kept walking away. So, communing with nature. Nature is a thing. It's very sweet. I uh, got somebody asking a question. Uh, sorry, I missed the name, but I saw the question asking how Anime North was. I had a great time. Nice. Fans up there were amazing. Venue was awesome. And, man, it was way more crowded than I thought it would be. It was insane. Like, they spread the convention. Like, because Toronto doesn't have a space large enough for the size of a convention it is. It's spread out between the Toronto Convention Center and I think three or four or maybe even five hotels in the area. So it, it's just huge. And it was a lot of fun. I had a great time. We got to meet a lot of great people. A couple bit shout outs real quick. We got Kirkayla. Hope I'm pronouncing that right with a thousand bits. Thank you kindly, Kirkayla. We got Krasim Andoran saying, hey guys, first time catching a stream. So hype for episode 59. I'm in Australia and it's 9 a.m. right now. Blind. Shit, you woke up early for this. Yeah. Well, wow. early by our standards. <laughs> wait, yeah. wait, what time? 9 a.m. Oh, yeah. No, that's, that's, early. that's early, That's early, sir. That's past Scott's bedtime. <laughs> uh, we got Griffin Durame with a thousand bits. Says, never cheered this before, but y'all are awesome. Continue being thus. Oh, thank, thank you. you. Thank you so much. You know, when I tell some people that I wake up at noon, I always think that they might judge me, and I'm like, please do not judge the fact that I go to sleep late. I'm yeah, you get, like six, you get like six hours of sleep waking up at noon. Maybe. Yeah. When you're lucky. Um. Setsuri with 500 saying, shut up and take all my bits. Okay, guys, moment of silence for the bits. You gotta shut up and take them. <laughs> oh, shit! Uh, okay. <laughs> Donald Duck screwed up the moment of silence. <laughs> Thanks, Donald. <laughs> Ruining everything. It's just what he does. 
Peter Patara asks, question for the couch. Any advice on starting a voice acting career on YouTube? Hmm. Start, practice. Eventually, you're probably going to have to put some money into it. Yeah. Because well, good microphones are... Here's the thing. There, there are some pretty decent USB condenser microphones out there these days. I mean, the Yeti is a pretty good starter. Yeah. I mean, it's... The Yeti, the Yeti is basically, like, if you are trying to do any sort of voice acting on the internet, you cannot go any lower. Cannot go any lower than the Blue Yeti. If, if Understand, you're, if that's your bottom rung. Yeah, that yeah. is your bottom rung. And, it, and, these are, and these are speaking as people that started with, like, I started with, like, a Logitech yep, headset. Yep, Logitech headset. Yeah, yeah, that that floor has raised quite a bit since those days. CO1U used to be the the floor. Then I still got my CO3U. Yeah, um, but yeah, and even then, the Blue Yeti is not as good as an actual XLR mic. You are not going to get the clarity and the depth of the sound that you want if you want to be a professional without an XLR mic. And then you also know how to use it, and that's difficult. You have to learn a lot. Um, so USB mics are not what you want to do if you want to be a professional. But if you cannot, just absolutely cannot get an XLR mic, the Blue Yeti can mostly do the job. Yep. yep. I, I, I like people in the chat asking, when does it start? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'll I'll throw out there walk-in closets, decent uh, <laughs> decent sound, decent booth. impromptu sound booth. If it's the best you got, it is better than your living room. Yeah. Probably yeah. <laughs> failing uh, failing that. I mean, if you want to actually start by putting some money into it, the Chaotica eyeball is actually very good. Yeah. Nuka Heart with three thousand bits, bits for Kaiser because he's amazing. Thank you. I appreciate it. It's a lot of bits for being amazing. I'm jealous. <laughs> well, maybe if you were amazing, you'd get thirty bucks too. One day. One day. <laughs> Guys, I got I got a hundred bucks from a slot machine yesterday. Oh, nice! How am, am I amazing? Nice. That's pretty amazing. <laughs> Where's there a slot machine around here? Did you go all the way over to like uh, Windstar? You know, Windstar? Yeah. You went all the way to Windstar, huh? Yeah, it's like an hour away. But yeah, a friend of mine said, "Ben, you seem like you've been stressed," and I said, "Yes, I have." And she <laughs> said, "Can you clear your schedule for the rest of the evening and most of tomorrow?" So yeah. So that's what. Oh, okay, cool. Yeah. So yeah, drove me out. She's. Friend of a friend has a is like a high roller dropping lots of money on blackjack, so she gets so comp. they get a lot of free rooms and yep. stuff. Yeah, so she had a comp room she didn't want to use, so we just went, put some money in some slot machines, wound up like fifty bucks ahead at the end of the night. My nice. mom's friend is a uh, among other things gambling addict, uh, so she gets like a lot of free rooms at like Vegas and stuff like that. So she's often like taking my mom down to like Vegas weekends and stuff. I say among other things lightly. <laughs> 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 well, Epam gives 500 bits, says, here's some bits for Lanny for being okay. Yes! <laughs> You're one-sixth of the way there! Yes! Your mediocrity I am is okay! to be <laughs> I'm getting there! <laughs> <laughs> With a clock up there, you can see exactly how long that took. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> how long did it take? I think about seven, eight seconds. Yep. <laughs> Well, with that clock up there, you can see how long it took. I wasn't actually paying attention. No, I'm just like, I noticed it partway through. Uh, I like being able to use that. We don't get to use it very often when we're not doing, like, the drinking streams. Yeah. When we're, like, it's not a, fighting it's a, bosses. It's a fun chime. I want to get the... I think it's still on the keyboard up there, but whatever the divine, like, shining sound is. Oh, yeah, we one used of my to have favorites. that on here. It used to be where... <laughs> yeah. Was, you know, that one, yeah. Yeah. I, I think that one's just always, like, just fun to just... Exclamation point! A, a <laughs> statement. I was kind of mad. I it, it is the it is the uh, soundboard equivalent of a dab. Yeah, <laughs> I, I was sort of mad because I've never been able to use it like consistently ever because I've never been close to it. And then on the Snatcher stream, oh, that's right. Yeah, it was broken, <laughs> and so I couldn't use it. Yeah, we did yeah. figure that out. By the way, that was an extension cord problem. Uh, we got fifty seconds <gasps> left. <gasps> wow. Actually, we have forty-six seconds left. Well, when in I said it, a minute, it was, we'll live in a post regardless, we have less than a minute. Whoa. Oh, holy Hello. crap. Probate dropping the bombs. Hold on. Let me get a final count on that. Yo, yeah, let's check it out. Probate. That was, yeah. that looks that was like a nuke. A hundred. Yeah. One hundred thousand bits from probate. Damn. Wow. Probate. Damn. Thank you very Thank much. Thank you, sir. Thank you kindly. Did he just break his old record? Or? No. Uh. He has not <laughs> broken his old record, but that is still a phenomenal. An amazing amount. drop. Uh, here. 
I'm pretty sure I'm his pretty old sure record his is... old record is the max yeah. you can drop. So wow, <laughs> holy shit! Yeah, don't don't be a prude, Kaiser. <laughs> no, no, no. I was... <laughs> also, we got Taka in the chat. Also, hi Taka. Hi, hi Taka. Taka. Hi. Bye Taka. <laughs> Everybody, enjoy Dragon Ball Z Abridged episode fifty nine. Yay! And we're back. Ha! So I could tell from the comments that people were pretty much liking it. <laughs> it it's great being positive. able to read it as it's going. Yeah, I love, yeah, I love no. this live reaction. Yeah, it's like having it on a stage, only you get to see what they're saying rather than just hear it's, a cacophony of laughter. Or yeah, o's. it's 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 like it's like a live stage experience for the hearing impaired. Yeah. Just watching that. You know what else lets us know that people liked it? Huh. 3,000 bits from Inferno, whoa, whoa, 1,400 from Eitsu for Grant, by the way. We got Yo. 500 from Rack Bell. We got 500 from Murr Steak for Grant getting yet another line. Uh, yeah. Thanks a lot, you guys. Yeah, thank you so much, guys. And thank you all for joining us. Uh, for those of you, I saw quite a few people saying, like, shit, I made it in late. Don't worry, we will be re-premiering it in, uh, well, encore presentation in about... 25 minutes or so, something like that. Yeah. Half we, an hour. Can we get another clock up there to tell people? Uh, yeah. Give me just a second. Uh, yeah, we'll set it to 6.45 whenever you... Yeah, I'll, uh, I'll get that going in just a second here. No problem. We'll get uh, another timer up there. But for right now, this is Q&A time. I'm going to see what Woo! I can find off of there. Yeah, unfortunately, I've not. <laughs> I set realize it to I slow haven't. Mode or anything. Yeah, well, we haven't set it to slow mode, and we also. Uh, holy crap, Matt Whoa. Ben Big! Bam! With one, two, three, four. Hold on, let me find the. Uh... Everything's exploding! Yeah. Boom! Let's see. Boom, doesn't, baby! Doesn't look like. Oh, jeez, Sorry, there we go. Yep, looks like another anymore. 100,000 bits from Matt Ben Big saying, yeah, fuck Goku. Ha! <laughs> Yeah, fuck Goku. You know what? I uh, realized afterwards that Grant, we were the star of this episode. I realized <laughs> afterwards we were dunking on Masako, and I could have said, "Yeah, fuck Goku" at some point, and it would have been some great foreshadowing. Yeah, I'm Damn. not that smart. I'm sorry, guys. Damn. I'll t hey, guess what? For the for the encore presentation, now I've foreshadowed it. There you go. You foreshadowed it <laughs> yeah. after the fact. Yeah, you know, Pr like post shadowing, yeah, fuck Goku. as it were. <laughs> Got him. Yes, that was that was a Harry Potter poster at the at the end. Yep, we. I think that was like a suggestion that we made came up with like yesterday, wasn't it? Uh, yeah, yeah. When you were watching, and no, <laughs> Videl's line was not the one I was waiting on. Uh, Sarah Ann Williams got that to me. The voice of Tifa from DB or uh, Final Fantasy VII: Mission Abridged, <laughs> and Jinx from League of Legends. Ooh. Yep. So, um, and to answer the next question, no, I don't know if she's going to play her in the actual booth. Yeah, we, we haven't cast grown-up Videl yet because we haven't finished Cell yet. Yeah. Um, These things take time, people. Yes, they do. So. Uh, question, when are we getting more Final Fantasy VII Machine Abridged? I believe it should be. It's in production right now. It yes. should be out coming this fall, hopefully. Yeah. <sighs> Holy shit. <sighs> <laughs> um... Yeah, just yeah. Oh, geez. boom, explosions. M music fan with another 25,000 bits for all of TFS, but mostly Lanny because he is mega awesome. Yes! There you go, mega <laughs> awesome. <laughs> we also got, got Tetressin with 1,500, Number Hunter with 1,500, uh, Link2799 with 1,500, Light Infinity with 1,500 saying... This goes to Taka for killing it as Cell. Thank you all so much. Taka, nice. that goes to your next trip down here. Hey. <laughs> uh, Putting it in the bucket. See a couple of people asking, should I, or saying, should I missed it? Don't worry, we do plan an encore presentation here in about 20 minutes or so. Yeah, 6.45. Yeah. Nope. So, um, 45 past the hour, 15 before the hour. Quarter till. Yeah, quarter for those till. Of us in the no. Three quarter past. <laughs> and how many quarters of? No, none quarters of. Okay. No, no, that's one, yeah, because that would be a that, vague and imprecise yeah, saying that, that makes no sense. Yeah. It's a quarter until the next hour. It's a quarter till seven. A quarter. See, my there husband. My husband introduced me to the phrase "blank of," and I was like, "What the fuck is that? Ten of go. three? What?" This timer. When this runs out. <laughs> when this timer <laughs> runs out, your time is up. <laughs> But yes. What's an hour? I'm going to need all the marbles, Mr. President. 
but yeah. So hey, how about this? How about this? What was everyone's favorite line from the episode? Oh, geez, you're gonna do that? <laughs> I was here to ask. I was here to answer questions, and now you're gonna get oh. this motherfucker swarmed. I, I mean, no, no, no. I'm asking you guys. Oh, I'm asking the couch. Us. Oh, us. Us. That's hard. Yeah, right. Uh, I liked Mr. Satan's. Uh, oh, talking about how gambling isn't a joke or whatever, whatever the exact line was. Got a lot of people Got saying, fuck "Yeah, fuck Goku." Hey, well, I, yeah. I'm hey. so happy to see "fuck Goku" is such a popular phrase. I've been saying that since before it was my line. <laughs> well, Boom. I can tell that that was A to the Dub's favorite because he just dropped ten thousand bits to that Thank effect. Thank you very much. Thank you kindly. Hey, yeah. A to the Dub. Um, let's see. I think I don't know if it's necessarily like. My favorite like line in the episode. Okay, I can look that way now. Yeah. Uh, but <laughs> my favorite part was like Piccolo and Goku's final back and forth there. Which one was it, Goku? Which concussion was it I did. that made you think this was a good idea? I really liked the cut back to Gohan just getting pummeled. That was was pretty good. Yeah. Solid stuff. I, uh, oh. Yeah. <laughs> just getting that. that out of the way. Yeah. Yeah. Sorry. Um, I would say that my favorite joke overall in the episode um, is either, yeah, the gambling line where he just looks away is like, which is actually a serious, a serious problem. problem. <laughs> yeah. um, mostly because I just love the, uh, I love the art that Curb did on that. It, it was actually like really good on his part. Um, but, you know, I think my favorite joke actually has to be just the warp kamehameha i love how that scene came out it paced out very well if it, the one thing i think worked the best with the footage was chi chi's with a butter knife he's lifting up that old ass <laughs> tv just shaking it around oh yeah I, we wrote that scene and i knew exactly how it was going to go um and so I, I i'm happy when we write stuff out where i'm like okay i know the exact animation that i'm, I'm going to use to make that scene work so there are some times where we write and i just we don't even know what footage we're going to use. We just know, wait, they're in that same scene, right? Okay, let's go. I got people asking, when will it be uploaded on the channel? I believe it will be up at, like after the stream. In 38 minutes. Yeah, 38 minutes. Well, not after the stream then, but midway through the stream. And by the way, for those of you who want to stick around, we will be playing some Jackbox Party <gasps> Pack after this. So you can jack jump off in with and, us. Yeah, jump in and jack off with us. Just... Have a good old time. A Jackbox Jackoff. It'll be great. By the way, a lot of people have been asking uh, who animated Videl. Um, and that is actually a longtime animator friend of ours who has done a lot of work on the series, Zach Manley. He's, been doing, he's done some great work for us in the past. Uh, anytime you've seen Nappa in a business suit, that's been him. Yeah. If you watched the VGTA animated parody, that was him. Um, let's see. Yeah, it, it, he's done a he's done a lot of like anything that we've needed full on cell animation for. That's been him. Yeah, and and you know, animated you know animation for characters who are in cell as well. So <laughs> yeah, I was gonna say cell animation, huh? Yo! So he's only been working for this latest arc. Yeah. By the way, the name of this episode uh, is actually the hard cell. Yep. <laughs> We, um, we have a, we have we have the <laughs> swing. Yeah. We have the names for the next couple of episodes. Actually, I, I don't mind saying the name of the next episode. It's super good. Yeah, I came up with it just earlier. I'm really happy with it. Go Han or go home. <laughs> yep, I'm very much looking forward to that. Um, do episode breakdowns? No, I'm sorry. They they get it. I have I have the show to work on. I cannot work. Yeah, it's it's a it's a matter of like which do you want more? Do you want the breakdowns or do you want the episodes? Because right now we're on a pretty good pace when it comes to scripting these. We still have yeah. a couple. We still have one and a quarter in the book or something yeah. like that. Yeah, yeah. We had. I was so happy to have two scripts done before I'd even started. It was amazing. Um, also. Uh, a lot. I saw a lot of people mention kale. No, it is not a reference to kale. And yes, it is a reference to kale. Got it. Can't be any more clear than that. Yep. Next president of the United States over here. <laughs> Real quick lightning round. Thank you, introspective spy who drops two thousands to Kaiser as a bribe to get some goddamn sleep. <laughs> Kill Sassinator has been dropping bits all stream. Thank you, Kill Sassinator. We got fifteen hundred from Kimalito saying that was great. Laugh myself to tears. Uh, here, Yukagane with 1500 says, For that gut buster of an episode, I bow in the sheer amazingness of all your brilliant minds. Thank you, and... Oh, hold on. And even you, Grant. <laughs> even me. Even Grant. Yeah. I made it, guys. <laughs> You're here. We hey. got 1500 from Candy After Dark saying, For Lanny, because Vegeta is the hype. 
and Dr. Thank Butts you. saying these bits yeah. are for Kaiser Ben and Grant, who also deserve some love. Thanks, Doc. We got a thousand from Gola from Beloa for the great Piccolo dad moments and for jacking it later. Thank yep. you all so much. No, yeah, absolutely. Thank you for all the bits. Piccolo is best dad. He's the best dad in the show. Yeah. No, By I, far. Absolutely. Um, there's, a, there, there's a line in the next episode that I'm not going to spoil that I'm really looking forward to. Yep. Actually, a couple. Um, Piccolo is my favorite dad. Piccolo is best dad. Ooh, damn. Uh, Jason Wolf informs us. I'll have to look this up to confirm this. Apparently, we're number three on Twitch right now. Ooh. What up? Yeah. Cracking hey. that top How's it five. going, awesome. Twitch fam? Yeah. Well, that's, Join that's the great. party. Guys. Yeah, just so everybody knows, like, down, yep, this finger, follow this one, I guess. Yeah, down there, you can see our schedule coming up. Uh, Wednesday over there right now is the meme stream. That's with Taka and Zito. Uh, yeah, you'll yeah. see our schedule down there when we usually stream. Yeah, that, that cycles every few minutes there. Uh, yeah, we got one of our mods saying, can confirm, number three on Twitch. Holy nice. shit. Word. Thank you all so much for tuning yeah, in. Yeah, thanks so Welcome, much for everybody. tuning in. And uh, if you just tuned in... This little clock up here shows when we're going to present a encore presentation of the episode, and after that, we'll be doing some Jackbox. It'll be a good time. Good time to hang out with everybody. Be it's fun. always great to hang out with you, because normally this is a casual Friday. Now it's a DBZA Friday. Hold on. Which is about yeah, I got a hell of a pit stain right now. Beautiful. <laughs> nice. He's on. sweating talent, folks. I'm just, I was so nervous for the episode. He's leaking. Um, uh, I guess, yeah, I guess we can answer this right now. If people asking, is episode 60 going to be the season finale? I pushed for that so fucking hard. <laughs> but the, it would be like a three hour episode. Yeah. We still have work. so much to go through. It made me so sad that we weren't able to fit it all into 60. Um, uh, a warning the next episode is going to be on the shorter end, but that's because we wanted to make sure that there's a good, long, a big setup for what will be the finale. Um,. So you can expect 60 to be a little shorter than this one, which was damn near on 15 minutes, but you will get a lot coming up after that. In fact, we were pretty divided on making 59 and 61 episode, but that would have been tooth. Yeah. Um, actually, there was a part of me that wanted to take, and in, in retrospect, I wish I'd still done it. I wish I'd actually taken the, uh, I, I cut that episode off at the uh, Exploding the Ring. Hmm. I could see that. I guess. Yeah. And then maybe putting a bit... Well, actually, no. Then this one could have still been the same length, I guess. I don't know. It's hard to say. Yeah, it's, it's hard to say. But honestly, I really did like... I... I this... I did not, did not expect the Cell games to be this many episodes. But there's just a lot that goes on there, and I don't... You gotta hold you out there. The aborted oh. cup saying, it is their oh, birthday tomorrow! <laughs> if it is your birthday today... Happy goddamn birthday! You get a new episode of DBZA! If it is your birthday tomorrow, I'm bored and caught up, I'm looking at you! Happy birthday! Happy birthday to everybody! Happy birthday, Big Giant Ben! Happy birthday to all of you! Yes, spam that Melvin Ivan! It's great! Happy goddamn birthday! I feel like we're just careening down the Twitch rankings as you <laughs> And fun. we're number 20! 20! <laughs> Actually, uh, you know what? You know what? One of these, one of these days, you're gonna go out of town. You're going to come back. You're going to hit that button. It's going to so be a different birthday <laughs> song. I'll be fine. <laughs> as long as it's a song for a... Oh, birthday! I'm fine. I can't remember what the regular show birthday song was. Back when the happy birthday was still copywritten. Yeah. yeah. Weird Al's got a good one. Oh, yeah? Yep. Yeah. In, in fact, I think I sent that to you uh, like one of the first years that we knew each other. I made a... Uh, I was making a little AMV <laughs> quick cut compilation, as was the fad at the time, and then at the last minute went, oh, it's almost Scott's birthday. The yeah, this was the totally times. meant for you, Scott, just for you. <laughs> Animated birthday card. <laughs> By the way, for those who are asking uh, who voiced Videl, again, it was Sarah Ann Williams, a.k.a. the voice of Abridged, Abridged Tifa, and uh, Jinx from League of Legends. Very talented voice actress. I love her. She's great. She's and great super, to work with. Super sweet. Like the sweetest. Oh, hoping to see her at AX next week, which, by the way, uh, on oh, yeah. the couch, Grant and I, <gasps> as well as Me? Taka, my wife, and uh, Howard oh, will be joining God. us for a bit, will be at our booth at Anime Expo. Wow. It'll be a hell of a party. If you are in LA or plan to attend Anime Expo, please feel free to drop by, say hi, look at our t-shirts, maybe even buy one. We'll sign stuff for free. It'll be a good time. 
Awesome. I you know what else is a good time? Gimmick. Oh, man. Is uh, lightning round, bit callouts, Cloud Rider with a thousand bits. Thank, uh, you, thank you, Cloud Rider. Wants to know uh, if episode 60 will be multi-part. I feel like you guys already answered we that one. We did answer that one. Frankenstein's Gate with 1,500. Uh, 69 for Ben, 69 for Scott, 69 for Lanny, 69 for Grant, and 420 for Mr. Popo. Whoa. <laughs> nice. Whoa. Good call. <laughs> hey. Oh, that's another one of my favorite jokes. The we yeah. Yeah. yeah, that was a big hit I saw in the chat. Uh, we got Volus with 1,500 bits thanking me for taking the hard job of keeping up with the chat and donations. Guys, if I have missed any, any bit drops, I'm so sorry, but they are coming fast and furious, and we want you to know we're grateful to all of you. Yes. Thank you all kindly. Yep. We've also got Neo Sailor Mars, Rectangular, Wild Hair, The Lone Courier, High Ultima with 5,000 bits. Thank you. Love the bit where Cell and Vegeta were mimicking each other. Thank you, High Ultima. By the way, again, if you uh, missed the episode earlier, it will be re-airing in... Time. That time. Yeah. <laughs> and for those not looking at the chat like a bunch of putzes, uh, yeah, up there, 13. <laughs> or not the chat, the video of us on the couch. <laughs> Look at the video. You can be listening to it in the background. Yeah, basically. In an amount of time, you'll hear the episode again, those of you not watching. And then shortly after that, it'll be up on YouTube. Yeah. So I I know I saw one question scrolling by. Who was, whose idea was it to have Vegeta and Cell talk in unison? Um, Actually, I think that was mine. Might have been. Yeah. Yeah, I remember that. It's it's always hard to say, like, whenever whenever it comes to asking, like, whose idea was what, it's, it's weird because, like, we script as a team... And often it'll come down to the fact of, like, each of us will sit there and think, yeah, I think I came up with that. And then, <laughs> be, like, usually there's some truth to all of that because we always modify each other's jokes no matter what. So it's always kind of a team effort. Yeah. That, that, one, that one I can actually firmly say that I was voicing that one. And you probably helped me mold it, but yeah. It's a group effort. It takes a village to make a joke. Yeah. You came up with the yo. Yeah, that was me. <laughs> that was so good. I, I, God, I know weed humor is like really low on the totem pole, but it's really about the delivery of that line that matters. <laughs> Joint jokes, as I call them. Stoner humor. I got it. <laughs> no, I just, I, I, I love, honestly, Dende is one of my favorite characters in this season. Um, he's a, he he's, just showed up. Yeah. He's fresh. Dank Him, Jimmy, fuck. Firecracker, Android 16, and Guru are all going to have the best party in hell. <laughs> <laughs> we got... What do we got? We got uh, Killix Fox with 1,500 bits. Thank you. Says, loved it. How long will the hiatus be between the Cell Saga and the next? And will you be skipping the Otherworld Tournament with one episode Ooh, like Garlic Jr.? Absolutely not. No, we will be doing the Otherworld Tournament. We've got to do Ulibu Justice, guys. Come on. You mean best character. <laughs> you know, I'm wondering if we're going to call him Olibu or if we're going to call him Olive. We'll probably go with Olibu. Um, Just Hercules, who he's clearly supposed to be. Stop calling me Hercules. That's not my name. I'm <laughs> Samson. Look at these glorious locks. <laughs> Come on. I am from the Old no, don't Testament. Cut it! <laughs> <laughs> my um, powers! As, of, as for how long it's going to take, um, don't really know. It's I, hard I, to say. It depends on if we change our structure, because we've been debating for a little bit about whether or not we want to uh, just take a break to script a bunch and maybe edit a few so we can actually get a proper, you know, season schedule going. But that, again, would take time. And, you know, maybe if we had something running in the meantime, we'd be able to do something like that. But yeah. we got a lot of people who are incredibly, incredibly impatient. <laughs> just one or two. Yeah. Um, but yeah, yeah, I'm not talking to you, but you know I am you talking are. to you. Are you yeah, talking you... to to them or them? No, I'm talking to the kid with asthma. Okay, so not them, but them. them. <laughs> I like that angle. We got even though to... I'm not in it. <laughs> Here you go. Now uh, you can be in it. No, too. I like the other angle. It looks good. Yeah, no, you Grant set yeah, up no, these angles. The... Yeah, there, there are a lot of people out there who are incredibly patient. And in fact, most of the people that tune in for our live streams typically the best people. <laughs> yep, you're the best. You're the best around. Uh, but, uh, yeah, there, there, there's oh, there's always the person where one of the first 20 comments on an episode is, FINALLY! 
Even if the episode, even if the previous episode just came out like a month ago, I like have, I have noticed, this. a lot of people this time around are pretty happy with the turnaround time. Yes, on no, one. and that's coming around because there there have been times where we've been long between episodes, and usually that's because we make like a thirty or a forty minute movie in between, and people don't count those for some reason because <laughs> they don't take work. Duh. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, that's that's something that I've picked up on doing some of like the Facebook messaging and stuff, and just seeing like. You know, it's like the day after a mo like Broly dropped or something, and so when's the next episode? I know you guys just put out the movie, but like you got like the episode's got to yeah, be like almost done, right? Yeah, people are working on the episode like, at the same time as the movie, yeah, right? I feel like they think that there's like two different teams that work on them or something. <laughs> I wish. I, I I understand the mentality. Just like way back in the day when we first started, uh, first started like doing stuff as Team Four Star. I remember seeing comments like. Wow, this guy makes great videos. Just like assuming Team Four Star is one person. <laughs> team Man, Four this guy's got such it. a yeah, range. Yeah. Team Four Star, who's also a brony. Yeah, Team Four Star <laughs> is a, a brony. brony. I remember that comment. Oh my god, that is. Oh god, that's five years old at least. <laughs> oh, definitely. Because <laughs> oh, when, when, when was the last? When was the last time like bronies were even like part of the zeitgeist? Yeah, at least three years ago. Yeah. I'd say. But um, you yeah, know that. I want to, we, we were trying to get the episodes out faster, but... Yeah, we're working on that. That's why we, we're, like, trying to stick very heavily to our scripting schedule and making sure that everything stays on schedule so that we have something to work on and keep things rolling. That's why episodes have been coming out slightly quicker than usual, as a lot of you have noticed. Yeah. yeah. And some people who've noticed include Surico with 1,500 bits for Lanny because he wishes he was a carrot. We got, uh, let's see, I already called that one out. Uh, Citizen Lawyer with 750 fuck Goku bits. Yeah. Uh, the Kid with Mazma dropping 1,000 bits saying, Hey guys, love all your content. Are there any jokes you wish could have made it into the episode? Hmm. Like In this one. one specifically, I feel like we, we ended up with the draft we wanted. Uh, I think there were a couple of things that just were never going to work with the footage that we had to cut, but they're lost to time at this point. Yeah, a, a lot of the time we, I'm sure there's one or two jokes that are pitched. There's, that there's, there's aren't. always stuff that we're like, oh man, this is great, let's put it in there, and then you have to be the Debbie Downer ball because you're the one who's actually paying attention to the footage. <laughs> I'm always the guy who's like, guys, this joke is hilarious. It's not going in. <laughs> it, it, this literally cannot work. There Good is job. no scene of Cell and Goku making out. It just doesn't <laughs> exist. Why not? <laughs> Zack Manley can make it happen. Which, that's just like a, a but note not to... in this amount of time. No, yeah. no. See now, what I really want to do is just have him find a fucking video of two dudes just making out and then rotoscope it with Cell <laughs> and Goku. <laughs> Technology's that, coming along. Just that high, that uncomfortably high frame rate animation, <laughs> the one that just makes you kind of get really uncomfortable. <laughs> yeah, he has to find a video like that. You mean find your cell phone. <laughs> <laughs> I, don't, I just don't think I'd be a good model for either of them. Well, that's all. I... Yeah, fine, so. Guys, we got Volus with, with 1500 saying, do you have any idea who might be a good voice for PyCon? Yes. We have a couple of people in mind, I think. Yep. One specifically, but a few on the short list. Yeah. Uh, Wolfman dropping 1500 saying, love the content. Asking uh, if you know yet when the new Nuz when the next Nuzlocke might be coming out and whether it might be platinum or something else. It's definitely going to be platinum, but it's <gasps> going to be a little bit of time. Yes. Yeah. And we got Mad Jack with 4,000 bits saying, a small gift in comparison to what you guys give us. Thank you for everything. Oh, thank you so much. Thank you, Mad Jack. And Morty Z with a thousand saying, first bit donation ever, you are beautiful humans. Aw, thank you. Yeah, thanks, Snatcher Z. So nice to, that we can live with the robots in peace. Finally. Damn Snatchers. <laughs> ah, a little over five minutes remaining. Yeah. And that's five Earth minutes. Yeah. And not, this planet's going down. <laughs> and not five frost demon minutes. Does Puddin <laughs> like hugs? Of course she does. She loves hugs. Wraps herself all around. She's got those stretchy arms. She's... By the way, who's excited about the next World Martial Arts Tournament with Kieran as the announcer? Ooh. I'm, I'm super excited myself because I love... It'll I've... be an interesting arc to write. Yeah, especially since a lot of the, like, a lot of the front runner, like, the front row characters are switched up pretty heavily. Mm -hmm. I mean, you're, you know, you'll be fine. 
Um, Krillin kind of takes a step back, but Piccolo... So does, uh, Piccolo takes a step back at the beginning, but Vegeta's there in the beginning, and then he tags out for Piccolo. Yeah. I love that Piccolo gets such a huge role in that arc. Do you think you'll play Majin Vegeta any differently than standard Vegeta? Uh, I don't think I'll play him much differently. He's just going to be, like, kind of going back to, like, him being a complete asshole like he was in Season 1 and 2, basically. Yeah, the writing writing for Vegeta in this next arc is going to be so much fun. Oh, it's going to be great. Writing for Vegeta when he's at his most badass and when he's at his weakest Ooh. is the best. Neb's TV asks, asks a question that I'm actually curious about. Will the Boo Saga still use uh, sparking or will you switch it to We Got Power? Or oh, yeah, add? it's definitely going to be uh, We Got a Power. Yeah, nice. we're, cha we're changing it up to stick with what we got. By the way, somebody mentioned this in the chat and I would like to take a moment for this. Can we please have a moment of uh, silence and respect for Chris Ayers? He, uh, Chris Ayers, by the way, is the English dub voice of Frieza currently. Of, he didn't die, did he? No, but he just got out of surgery at double bypass. Oh, wow. So yeah, I just, like, so I'm, just, I'm just phrasing that. Moment of silence <laughs> usually means yeah. he died. I was, so. I was going to follow it up. Okay, but yeah. We're just, sending our, send, yeah, sending our best yeah. wishes to Chris Ayers yeah, for just, a speedy recovery. Yeah. He's a great guy. Yeah, love you, dude. You know who else is... Great guys, that's that's a transition that I could make. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> Chappy nine with a thousand bits saying, "I love this episode, and I find myself loving Cell more and more as the arc goes on." Be sure to get some rest after a job well done, especially Kaiser. We you guys are. I'm not the only one that was confused by that. There's a lot of people in chat saying, "What the fuck?" The worst part is you cut me off before I was able to explain. I was literally about to say, "Yes," but just... starting with a moment of silence uh, yeah. is the worst thing to do. I, I got to back Lanny on this one, my dude. <laughs> All right, fine. <laughs> Reserved moment of silence is for death. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Caster Gaming drops 1500 and says, oh, speaking of moments of silence, uh, I got some bad news about a friend and you guys help ease the pain. Thanks for the smile, guys. Keep oh, it up. Sorry Terribly sorry. That. Yeah, sorry you're having troubles, but hope hope we can take your mind off of it for a little while at least. By the way, the entire chat uh, still going on about <laughs> which line I was waiting for. <laughs> um, it wasn't it wasn't uh, Sarah Ann Williams' line. Uh, Grant works with us at the studio. Pretty so... easy to get me. <laughs> There's one other person that had one line. <laughs> <Yep>. <laughs> if you can't catch it, maybe you'll be able to catch it in two minutes and 25 oh. seconds. And if you don't catch it in two minutes and 25 seconds, you can catch it in, uh... 15 minutes, minutes after that. Yeah, yep. yeah. You can catch it in 18 minutes. On the YouTube. On the YouTubes. But right now, I can catch a thousand bits from Chappy9. Oh, no. I already got that one. Agent Cryptic 500. Hey, howdy, Team Four Star. Thanks for keeping up the hard work. Uh, keep it up and all obey the giant floating head. Show me what you got. Uh, I got I'm, it. I'm going to have to add that to the soundboard. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Uh, learned a computer with a thousand for announcer Kieran. Oh shit! Yeah, and oh shit. Okay, we got some big ones. We got another fifteen hundred from Doctor Butts. Thank yeah, you. Yeah, thank you, Doctor Doctor Butts. And then another ten thousand from Floral Vikings uh, for she knows what I'm about and Grant for the second best line. Hey, number two ain't bad. <laughs> that that had something to do with the other line. Uh, yeah, she she knows what I'm about. <laughs> <laughs> Zing. Yeah. A lot of people like to forget that Roshi tried to watch her poop, or did watch her poop. I can't remember if he <laughs> yes, succeeds. Yes, yes, for an explanation of that line, there's literally an episode in Dragon Ball after Bulma has designed a watch that shrinks you down to I about feel like it's for expressly this purpose. Yeah, action figure size levels. So that Goku can carry her while he's doing the, yep. uh, while he's on the Nimbus Cloud. Exactly. Roshi steals that from her. And then sneaks into the bathroom, which and Bulma is about to use. And he watches her poop. Or pee, anyway. It's, I'm, I'm, she uses the bathroom. the bathroom. Poop is a funnier word, though. Yeah. yeah. And, uh, and somehow slightly less gross than watching her pee. I don't know how that is, but... I would say that's worse. I, 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 don't, I don't know. It's oh. hard, because it's like... One is more... Like, one feels more overtly sexual. Oh. But then again, I guess either could be... It's just weird. I actually just realized... I also had a single line in that episode, too. Oh, and did, uh -huh. did 16 we waiting as well? On you? Turtle. Well, no, you you did not just have a single line, though. You had many lines. Yeah, no, no, you were, but, yeah, you but were one of my characters had a single line. Did 16 only have one line? I two can't lines. remember. Okay, he had two lines. 
So yeah, there's one other character, and you can try to figure that out in 15 seconds here. Yep. But uh, real oh, quick shit. before oh, real that, quick, thank you, 1,000 from Mer Steak, asking if you'd like some locally made whiskey. Absolutely. Yes, 100,000%. Sure. Yep. 1,000 from Robbie G. Thank you, Robbie G. 1,500. Thank you, Czar of the Hall. And we'll count down the yep. rest of you after this. Yeah. Oh. Enjoy the episode again. For those of you that missed it, enjoy it for the first time. <laughs> There we there go. There we go. We're here. Done did it. We done, oh, done, done did wow. it. Wow. I saw a lot of people got it. The correct answer to who was the last person to get their line in was <laughs> Tien Shinhan. Oh! Now, in his defense, he's, he's had, a very busy boy. But. Yes, he's had cr like crunch time at work. He's been getting home when I've been here at the studio working like at two in the morning. So like, I, I sympathize with him and I was not mad at him, but literally I cut his line at four in the morning last night. <laughs> yeah, one of, the, one of the last minute things. He also lives on, he also lives on the uh, west coast. So yeah, yeah. that would have been like two his time. Yeah, his time's a little different. Yeah. Well, it would have been uh, midnight his time. All right, guys. So if we're gonna play four. some, if oh, we're yeah, gonna yeah, play yeah. some oh, Jackbox, yeah, sorry, yeah. I'm gonna have to kick us over. We yep. might go we're off. Gonna, we're going to briefly. change the preset real quick. We will be right back, and then we will jack off some Jackbox. Thank you all for joining us. For those of you who are sticking around just for the episode, thank you. For those of you who want to stick around to play some Jackbox with us, more power to you. We appreciate the support. We love you guys. See you on the other end of this blackout. <laughs> Oh, our mics are muted on this side, though. There we go. Our mics there are muted on this go. side. Okay, we're here. Okay. Yeah, we should be good. And we're back. Here we go. LG's going. Okay, Switch yeah. user, I believe, because this account does not have it. Grant, do you have Jackbox? Yes. Okay, nobody will be logging in on yours. My wife uses ours. Oh, uh, we don't have a preview camera anymore, however. Um. Or a uh, preview screen. Oh, yeah. Hold on. Let me, uh. No worries. Fix that real quick. There, there we go. go. Okay, we can now see everything. I see us. Hey. Ben, always on the ball. Yeah. Because that's why, that's why we call it. Sorry, did you say Ben always on the wall? <gasps> uh, People saying hide room code. Why would we do that? We want to play with you guys. Yeah. And I was going to say he's a baller. Because he's always on the ball. Ben the baller. Baller Ben. So all right, just to start everything off, I say we I, don't do it yet. So I can oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's let's all get ours up. All right, hold on. Let me get in here real quick. People are saying is still saying hide room code. Not gonna hide the room code. We want to play with people. Yeah, we want to play with folks. And we'll be able to get in before you because there's a delay. Yep. Yeah, it's wonderful. As long as we are on the ball. Okay, now people are just doing it intentionally. All right. Now I think they're just messing with us. Uh, Jackbox.tv, right? Yep. yep. I feel like starting off with some Quiplash is always a good start. Agreed. All right, here we go. All right. Entering Quiplash. Uh, hold on. To do changing my name. Be boring at first. All right, here we go. Actually, I'm going to have to sit this round out, gentlemen. I've got some tech stuff to figure out here on the no quick. No worries. Sure. Oh, okay. Uh, I think we'll just go ahead and say play game. Okay, yeah. I'm back. All right. Working on camera right. stuff. UKYI. Yuki. Uki. Uki. I think I've got this stuff figured out. I think I should be able to multitask here. You better hurry. Jump on in, guys. I'll be fine. Where are we, though? All right. Everybody's in! Let's go! Don't worry. You can join in the audience on this one, too. So feel free to jump in. Hey, Everybody's vote counts! Hello, I'm Schmitty, and I hope to meet or exceed your expectations. The great thing about a fresh game is that right now, you're all tied for first place. Yay! Remember, anyone who wants to join the audience can do so at any time by... You're that anyone can join the audience. 
And the best part about you not being in the game, you can still count out all the bit drops while we're waiting on round one. Well, he made it in. Two yeah, yeah. Oh, you're in? in. You're I am the big giant head. In any oh. clever or not clever way you want. Everyone will choose between your answer and someone else's and decide who wins. The more folks who choose your answer, the more points you get. Go. All right, here we go. Speaking of bits, we got Crow's Oatmeal with a thousand bits. I love that Goku avoids castration by blowing himself up. Crosses with 1,500. Spoilers! For the episode making me laugh so hard, I just burned half an eyebrow off at work. What are you, a fireman? Holy crap. What are you doing? Be careful. We got Joe Wolf HD with a thousand. Uh, asking, would you ever do Dragon Ball GT abridged, maybe even just in quickfire DBZ Kai form? We'll see when we get there. Yeah. We got Why Not Lane with a thousand bits. Thank you so much. Epam, thank you. And Tackless Fear, thank you so much. Thank you, everybody. Volus with another 5,000. Holy crap, thank you, Volus. Thank you kindly, Volus. It must be really easy reveal. with a keyboard. First, oh, yeah, it's great. <laughs> this is easy mode. Here from somebody sitting in front of you on a mega bus. All right. Okay, choose your favorite. Ooh. Jeez. Do da ba do do da ba do do. Look at all them audience votes. Yeah, oh, boy. Everybody's voting in. Go crazy, folks. You know what's right? Mine. <laughs> Yeah! Whoa, Mega Quiplash! Ooh. Oh, and I only barely win because of the audience. <laughs> the audience is what matters in this. Yeah, you are playing to everyone. Yeah. I mean, I'm glad I got all you guys, but uh, I felt lonely up there, so I decided oh, to join you guys down here. David Schwimmer nice. probably repeats to himself every day. It's voting time. <laughs> 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 Who That's David a Swimmer was for a second. <laughs> yeah, but in remembering how I know which one to pick. Yep, we all know what the right answer is. I trust the audience to do the correct thing. Oh! 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 Audience, <laughs> audience takes, it. takes it for him. Cam, I knew what the right answer with his was. pulse yep. on society. The hand on the pulse of society. The official <laughs> name for the Pope's underwear. <laughs> Okay, vote. A lot of alliteration. Yeah. I mean, have to. I mean, both are good, good uh, entries. But to be honest, I gotta go with the simplicity. Do you think the Pope's papal package is also pristine? See, the the papal package would be his junk, not what. Yeah, gotta go. Ah, oh, audience, <laughs> you betray me! Oh, it's a close one, though. You gotta learn to pander. Yeah. What? The, that's this. <laughs> yeah, you, you don't consider a papal penis, penis protector pandering? In James Bond's car is simply labeled blank. Float away. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, you know what? I'm losing this round, and I don't mind. Both, both of these an these answers work in conjunction. I will concede. Rape gas. Well, one is one of these is very. Bad. Oh, grow up, 007. <laughs> <laughs> hey, <laughs> I'm happy just to be nominated. That was a really good one, Scott. Oh, thank you. <laughs> I just thought about Next cutting up. out the middle. Yeah, you the worst know. Thing to hear as an art class paints your nude form. Vote <laughs> <Both> now. <laughs> <laughs> These are both, Those are both good. great. Oh man. I just, I'm having trouble with these huge veins. <laughs> I just need to get it so detailed. Oh, 
Yeah. yeah. Don't Pretty feel decisive. bad, Oxymoron. Don't feel bad, Oxymoron. Oxymoron, yours yeah. was really good. Still, that good was a injury. strong second. Next on the list, a terrible place to dump grandma's ashes. <laughs> Time to vote. What? <laughs> oh, I think somebody went safety quip. Of that, or maybe it's like they blend in too well. Actually, yeah, come to think of it. Oh, yes, for those of you trying to vote in chat, it doesn't quite work that way. Yeah. Yeah, I, I, I thought that. What up? Damn. Oh, shit. What up? Damn. You all know what's up. Thank you. <laughs> Coming up next, a good nickname for Wolf Blitzer. How is that not a great nickname? Ready, set, yeah. vote. Yeah, I gotta go with <laughs> Pandery, but I love it. <laughs> Yo, that's the name of the game. Mm -hmm. Play for those audience votes. Chinese players are usually the best at this because they know how to panda. Ooh. Ooh. Pandering not quite working with this crap. Oh. Buy a hair, though. Got close. Yep, real close. Stranded. And next, the most important part of Canadian sex. Put in your votes. <laughs> Taka can confirm. You're still in the chat. I thought about going with caribou because that's technically more accurate. But... Whoa, spoilers. Yeah, well, that's the most important thing about Canadian SNM is after caribou. Here's the thing. I knew they wouldn't Oof, mega, mega Whoa! whiplash. <laughs> Fucking take it! <laughs> Round All one right. is in the books. Let's see the scores. I'm pretty sure I'm in first place. Where are we at? Yeah, I am. <laughs> I'm dominating you, Big V. The face We're coming for you. <laughs> Round two is upon us, and all points disgusting. are doubled. Take that, round one. All right. something. Well, Chet's got a good point. Nobody's nobody's over here next to Grant. I'll fix that. Let's see how you did. There we go. Uh, Prompt number uh, one is a rumor that other birds. I'm not happy with Oscar either of mine. Yeah, I'm either. Yeah. yeah. I'm all right. Okay, use your device to pick your favorite. I can dig the they're secretly mutant dodos. The face sold it. Yeah. Sorry, Axel. Don't worry, moron. I'm not the one. Up next, a new term for when you're drunk off mimosas. And vote. <laughs> <laughs> It's not even the meme. 
You know, it's not. Um, I can appreciate it though, but I had to go with Lonely. Well, yeah, I, I did too. Thank you. Cool, <laughs> Fei Fei. CEO. Yeah. Yes, in the audience. Audience yeah, pulls it through. The audience knew what was up. I don't quite Next remember what mimosas are. I had plenty of other singles bar for pirates. <laughs> it's, uh, is it champagne and orange juice? Because I was going to put homosexual, but I wasn't sure. <laughs> oh, <laughs> shit. Yes, okay. no, that would have been perfect. It's like, yeah. Gay people and divorcees. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> like homosexual drinks, the Cosmopolitan and... Ah, oh, oh, you so safety quipped. I you still got votes. It's a shitty, shitty, you got yeah, votes. It's a shitty question. I forgot to vote. My <laughs> questions were pretty shitty too, but I still answered them. <laughs> I spent you way too long on the first one. First draft. Ah, ah, here it, it is. Davy Jones. Frankie, my dear, I blank. Vote on your devices. <laughs> I, I. Maybe he stutters. Maybe in the, I, 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 yeah, maybe in the first draft I, he was very nervous when he was saying Yeah, this. what kind of an idiot would write that, though? Putting two eyes <laughs> together, it was me. By the way, it's a vodka cranberry, not cranberry vodka. Thank you, Silver Edge and 335 people out there. I appreciate the pity. <laughs> and thank you, Shucks fam, for the 2000 bits saying, go, Shiny Grant, go. Moving on. A lame oh, thing weird. to say. Goes we were yeah, it's part, part Ben. <laughs> Put in your votes. Ben, ben blends in. <laughs> I'm not sure. I'll go with the one that actually sounds like would be said. Yeah. Origami swans. I'm pretty, I'm pretty, I'm pretty I, sure like I, a safety I quip, yeah. but yeah. yeah. But I also it would be really <laughs> lame to say just hey man. Yeah. Origami swans. <laughs> Good work, Cam. Okay, next one. Not a great batch of questions this time around. Restaurant where the workers don't wear pants. That's a good question. Time to vote. Mr. Alternation dropping bits. Thanks, Mr. Alternation. Thanks, Conley. Yeah. Go work, Grant. We actually, there's figured a place it's fast like, food and they're pantsless. It's pretty desperate. Actually, yeah. actually, there is a place like that Next called. Uh, Should you catch on fire? Tallywhackers downtown. It's a fast food place. Oh well, it's not good. For you. And vote. I don't know. It seems like they're trying a little too hard on that one. <laughs> you know what? Whoever just been, it could it just is. been asterisks there, really. <laughs> oh man, this was getting a lot of audience attention. Ooh. Of course, I would know about tally whackers. I've had, I've taken a couple of friends. Thank you, audience. <laughs> That's dumb. Hey, You're I, dumb. I, You're dumb. I had. Five seconds to go it's and fine. was drawing I've been a blank. Putting on so little mini what? plays with ghost snap, but still having New time to write answers. Pizza. Guys, come on! And lots and lots of blank. <laughs> vote now. <laughs> I like both of these answers. Wow. <laughs> Red Hedge asks, "Have you all thought about your pans for after Z? Uh, there's only one pan, and she's in GT only, I believe." She's in Super no. 2. Oh, is she? Okay, I've been watching Super. She's in Super and at the end of Dragon Ball Z. Oh, Man. yeah, I suppose so. Everybody hates me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. yeah. It was a shot. Somebody just abstained from the vote. I that hurts worse. You survived round two. Let's see <laughs> if the like, scores did. Are worth I think Kaiser's still in the lead here. I might actually have been overtaken. Oh, Ooh. you were by the Big B. Oh, and Grant. Grant. <laughs> yeah. Wow. No, so not much happened this turn. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. It's you're right. Both are much accurate. Accurate. Both are accurate. Look alive because That's you're all getting no the same yes. prompt this time. Grant, can you pull up the front? <laughs> Fuck you, Acrolash. You're a piece of shit. These hands are tough. Come up with a phrase. Acrolash is the worst. I wish you could turn it off. Great. Acronym TPP. A full name.
Acrolatch is dumb. Yeah, Acrolatch is the worst. It my, is definitely my least favorite the final worst. round. And Word Lash is like better, but not by much. Comic Lash is the only one I'm like, yeah, when I see it. You made it in, Oxymoron. You did it. Let's see what you've wrought. You get three medals to award to your top three quips. Give out your gold, silver, and bronze medals now. I have voted. Ask have I. Indeed. Indeed. Done and done. Done and dunner. Dumb and dumber. I wonder if that holds up. I haven't seen it, it since I was like eight. The first one might. I remember really like. All right, let's see where those. You know what holds up better than you'd Run. expect? The mask. Show me the silver. Oh, I bet. Actually. And finally, gold. Okay. And wow. Oh, I did not do well. At the points. <laughs> I think I think HBI won that one. Or please provide penis. I do that one. Yeah. Huh? Silver Edge. But was Silver Edge far enough like ahead to make work? That's with, all. Work now for the final scores. Let's see. Who I bet liar liar still holds up pretty well. Yeah. Oh, with the come from behind. Big giant wow. Man. Wow. Yeah. With my first round answer, <laughs> taking the victory. Yep. All right, gonna hit new players. All right, new players. Everybody get ready. Get ready. New player. One, two, it's reloading. Yep. L N S Z F. No. L N Z F. <laughs> Misspelled it. I'm out, bro. The big giant head wears the crown. No, I made it. You made it. Good. Whew, and just in time. I'll be right back. I'm going to pee. All right, we'll start it off because you can uh, play this big, from the bathroom. Big giant head is. Yeah, big giant head. You got to start us off. Here we go. Sit back and relax as we answer these questions as furiously and fastly. The as best possible. we can. Hi, I'm Schmitty, and you know what? I'm Hi, okay Schmitty. With that. Yeah, let's do this. There we go. Had to first put on the crown there. Crown him with many rooms. crowns. Very few players have died on. Oh, my they can't watch. see it from your uh, angle. Have deserved it. That's okay. The uh, <laughs> the words Here's are backwards anyway. So there we go. Based on the percentage of people who like your answer, and a bonus if you get more votes than your opponent. Go. All right, here we go. It begins. back up here so everyone can see my glorious All right, I'm pretty happy with my answers this time around backwards ass crown pretty happy with <laughs> dad sickoge <laughs> okay it's time for some quip lashing First one, what happens if you eat too many hot dogs? No such thing. 
Okay, pick your favorite and vote. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty sure that was heroin. Yeah. Oh, that's what kids are calling hot dogs out there. <laughs> yeah. That's the street name for hot dogs. <laughs> you just didn't have the audience on your side. Yeah, they most prefer a good poop joke most than you... making fun of the dead. <laughs> <laughs> Also, a moment of silence for Chris Farley. <laughs> also, I'm pretty sure a lot of our audience doesn't know who he is. Oh, that would make me so fucking mad. Vote away. Hmm, these are both pretty good. You know? Yeah. Those are both good. Yeah, and the and everybody kind of agrees. Yeah. See yes. what you did there with that Nintendo one. Though. Make golf yeah. More exciting. Good stuff. Ready, set, vote. <laughs> yes. I'm down for both of these. Yes, absolutely. Thank you, that one lunatic. That makes my heart swell. Okay, Croy Vile, you say we know who Chris Farley is? Oops, I keep forgetting when I... Yeah! When I yeah. untransform that at all. Come for that crown! Hey, that was a good one. Thank you. No salt about that. It's fine. <laughs> Your next prompt is... The weirdest ingredient to put in trail mix. I answered once with actual okay, trail. Okay, vote. What was that? What was the Futurama project uh, product? Like the only teeth strong enough to eat actual teeth. <laughs> Baby teeth are my yeah, go-to. Well, that's hey. gross and makes Plus. me uncomfortable. <laughs> yeah, that was terrible. Ronan of Death actually Moving thanks on. me for wearing the crown. No, thank you, Ronan of Death. He's the one who sent this thing, and I love it. Oh, hey! Yeah. I didn't notice. It's voting time. <laughs> Not quite dead says Johnson's teeth. Yeah, Johnson's teeth. The old teeth strong enough to eat other teeth. That's right. Thompson's teeth is what some people in the chat are saying. Yeah. I tried. But the audience gave it to oh! you. Yeah. Yeah. Looks like I know the people. The people have spoken for their king. Ha <laughs> ha! And next is the title of a sex ed book from the 40s. Get to voting. <laughs> <laughs> um. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! Ooh. Jesus. Fight. What is it with you and rape jokes? Look, all I'm gonna say I mean, I'm just What is it with you and rape jokes? All I'm gonna say is the one time I made one, the chat got I'm real mad at me. And I think it's pretty rude that, that they're so not that saying the dick about Kaiser. <laughs> Kaiser's gay, they don't believe in consent. <laughs> I, I love the fact that my stream character is out of touch dad who doesn't get PC-ness, so I get away with everything. So you can just keep going. It's okay, he's from a different time. It's okay. He's, he's older. <laughs> he's kooky old Ben. Next on deck, the name of a really crappy robot. Vote now. Somebody's playing my card. I don't think it'll win, but you got my vote. I don't Here's know what boss Borat means. I also think it's well, a crappy robot. I, so. I, I think it's a dyslexic robot that misspelled you're on my, robot. You're on my level, Grant. <laughs> yes! Yeah! The audience agrees! I'm not a fan either. Down with the worst android. 
I actually opened up a That's second tab one. to Let's figure out where the, the dash was. I wasn't out. sure. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I blew that one. I wanted to make sure I was accurate. Yep. Woo! <laughs> Thanks, Ghost Nappa. I took your answers that time. Onward to round two. Remember, all points and bonuses are doubled. Come on, good, good prompts. Goddamn pride! It is only slightly better than just putting in a blank answer. Well, I fucked up both of mine, so hey. Great. Cool. All right, let's have a look. Starting us off, if you want a really effective scarecrow, make sure it resembles blank. Okay, everybody, hey! pick your favorite. Fuck you! This one has a really awkward implications. Yeah, maybe. Haha! <laughs> Victory for my tiny penis! <laughs> I mean, wait! Next prompt. What lobsters think as they're being boiled? Okay, vote. I wonder which one you pressed enter on. <laughs> I know what you were going for, too. Hey, yeah. well, here's the thing. He could be dying as he's thinking this. So <laughs> <that's> <laughs> I'm not voting for it. <laughs> oh, but that's you! I didn't give it to you anyway! You got me! You got me! Next on the list, thank you guys. Martha Stewart's biggest pet peeve. You don't have to vote for the next one, though. And vote. I really couldn't come up with it. But was it enough? No, no, <laughs> not even close. You're, you're right, Chad. <laughs> I do not, I do not contest this. When we I go accept back my fate. The, the most awesome thing to say before you dramatically flip a scarf over your shoulder. <laughs> it's voting time. <laughs> I mean, yeah. I refuse. Grant, Man, this was such a good prompt. Yeah. There were so many things. Ice cream sandwiches blended with Ovaltine, Grant. That's what I'm, I'm handing it to it. Well, fuck you anyway. <laughs> what? That was an actual answer. Gah! Yeah. I was expecting a safety quip too. Tell Vegeta I said like a bitch is a very common safety quip, I know. <laughs> the title of an erotic movie for elephants. Vote on your devices. <laughs> Those are both pretty good. Wait, I don't get it. You just made this dirty. <laughs> <laughs> the ins and outs of what? 
Well done, both of you. I would have gone with Horton hires a hoe, but okay. <laughs> the White Brothers' first words after flying for the first time. Float away. I can't wait for this to get awesome, then shit. Did you hit enter twice? No, I just ran out of time. Yeah. So I went to go back and change it. Well, the audience gave it to you anyway. <laughs> well, the idea was that... Okay, next one. It used to be nice to fly, and now it's not. tradition you would like to see would be the seventh inning blank. I can't believe I won both of mine after fucking both of them up. Someone's trying too hard. You're like, fuck it, I don't care. <laughs> yeah, I like that seventh inning lech. <laughs> Gonna give it to Top Penis. Yep. Yep. Although, seventh inning lech is pretty good, too. I got your points here. Next one. Uh, I mean, it was a little bit of a seventh inning stretch. Blank. Ready, set, vote. Come on, Chet. Ah! Yeah. Hey, I'm I'm wearing this hat. I pretty much had to give you that. <laughs> I one. know. I, I thought the smiley face really sold it. Like it, I thought so too. It brought across some emotion, like air Man, conditioning. Ah! <laughs> Come on, be cooler. Oh so, shit! <laughs> I guess. Fuck you, yo! Yo, hey. still cooler. Yo, <laughs> like a bitch. Yo, yo. Round three, the last lash. Everybody's getting the you same bad prompt, joke, so don't hold back. back. Said, like, I write DBZA. I live on Agro bad jokes. Agro lash again. Fucking Fuck. hell. Come up with the We're changing yeah. games Who's after this. <laughs> you keep being names too, which is also Ugh. boring. Don't even care. Forget it. It's a dumb, dumb game. Doesn't dumb even matter. game with dumb rules. Stupid. Acro Stupid dumb game. Sucks. Let's see the responses. Yeah, just cover my face. I don't even care. Get medals now. Oh, dude, I love the. Oh, that that's so cool. Right. Uh, that's a good answer. I'll give it to that. People saying all these right. are all Let's dumb. Yeah, because yep. Acro Lash is garbage. Yeah, accurate. So here's the real weak final round. And gold. Oh, Let's shit! Those medals Nothing. for points. There you go, Grant's porn gaggle taking the win. Can't even take <laughs> credit for it. Yeah! My hey, porn is a the... gorge, not okay, a gaggle. Let's see those <laughs> final scores. Yeah, yeah. 
throw me all the way to the back Get of the bus. Dominated. Back of the bus. Oh, Grant, no <laughs> worries. Yeah. We're the cool kids in the yeah. back of the bus. <laughs> <laughs> it's bumpiest back here. This is where the cool yeah! kids sit. Yeah. <laughs> Taking my 83%. I'll live with it. All right. No one likes to play. Let's jump into a different us. game. All right. So we got how much time left? 20, 20 minutes. minutes. Yeah. So time 20 for minutes. one more game. All right. Do, do, do. Back to the pack. Back to the Roll pack. Roll back the pack. Let's see. Let's go with uh, once it decides to load. Boop. Boop. There we go. What do you think? Gespionage or Trivia Murder Party? I'd love to go uh, with Gespionage myself. Preferences? I'm, I'm trying to think if Gespionage has audience interaction. Does Trivia Murder Party? Uh, it says so. It says right up there. Audi oh, not, yeah, it no has an no audience can... interaction. Does oh. Gespionage? It does no, it doesn't. Uh, no, not no, players can join. Okay. Oh, hey! Cool. I, I would prefer Gespionage of the two, personally. But keep a coup with 1500 bits says I've been un right. unemployed for a few months and start my new job Tuesday. Here's some bits Congrats. for keeping my spirits up. Oh, yeah. and another 500 for Kaiser for all the hard work he does. Oh, thank you. All right. Gespionage. Here we go. It begins. Give me a second here. No, no. Okay. Good. That, my phone was loading. Get yourself to the page. Here we go, setting it up. K L J L. It's Why really does easy. Susan always post these flyers for agency? Kill girls Jill, now. my favorite Quentin Tarantino um, porn parody. Yeah, I, was, today, I am a weird frog. I am always going to be serious. What a Ooh. nightmare. How many movies? Hello, hello, TFS. Right. Hi there. Welcome back to the game, Oxymoron. I made it back in. Foolish humans. Sorry, names not required. You did miss the episode, but if you go to our YouTube, you can watch it. For it's right already now. up! Hooray! Attention agents, just Alright, guys, choose your pictures and we'll go in. Oxymoron and Cupid pond. Stunt. Come on, Continue Cupid Stunt. I'm looking pond. at you. Ha! Pick right your icons. You. you gotta be a face. You know what? Just start the game. They'll figure it out. It's you. You have to start the game, guys. Oh. All right. Three, two, Attention one. Field We're relying on you. Breathe it in. Everyone gets a face. Gay. Hello, we've been watching you. Wait, that sounded weird. We've been watching <laughs> you, and now we're sharing your secrets with the public. Hmm, not much better. Uh, oh, well. We made a game out of all this info, and we I don't call think it's it him, but this reminds me of the new host of Mystery Science Theater. Kind of, yeah. Sounds like... Jonah. Oh, and hey, we've got a live beat on your audience now. If we gather enough data from your audience, the questions are all about them. So I can't oh, wow. over this music. <laughs> so apparently, if the audience votes, like, the first? the entire thing is based on them. Oh, oh. Jesus. Oh, oh man, it's starting with me. All right, guys, so when you answer this question... Answer it's, honestly. Yeah, answer honestly. Do people have joined the Mile High Club by themselves? <laughs> oh. <laughs> yeah. By themselves? How many people have jacked off in a plane? Answer honestly, you sons of bitches! Yeah, come on. How many of you have jacked off in a plane? And about them or not. I wonder, I wonder if audience votes tallies into, like, the final that they give, like, other people. All right, folks. Yeah, have you jacked okay, off on a plane? Yeah, have you guys jacked off on a plane? For real, legit. You can also double down and guess much higher or much lower if you think the guess is off by 15 percent or more. I'm taking you at your word. I believe most of you have not. <laughs> In theory, <laughs> fucking Cupid stuff up here, going like way more. Not everybody's going in there. High five. I mean, it's self-reported, so you Hurry dummies up. might think it's funny to lie. I'm pretty sure everybody who just voted yes. Except for Oxymoron. I don't think Oxymoron's actually there. Well, that's really sad. Yo! Holy wow. shit! Wow! You, you are awarded. Right I have my finger on the pulse. Right on the eye of the pyramid. Yeah, the back uh, of your dick. No points for anyone else. I'm one of the 14 percent. Yes. I'm pretty sure everyone who just okay, voted yes there has probably. <laughs> <laughs> has done it themselves. <laughs> We've collected data about everything. All right, Kaiser, this. can you figure out how much of our fine audience have done 
Something about pet costumes. <laughs> wow, perfect! Yeah. What percentage of people have dressed dogs in costumes? Oh, I thought they meant dressing up as your pet. All right. That's right, everybody out there. I know exactly which ones of you have done it, too. <laughs> if any of you did it on a flight that wasn't, like, you know, across an ocean, I'm upset at you. How many comments am, am I going to get about? Of course Kaiser's the dog. Yes, of course I'm the dog. I'm a furry. What? I'm a weird frog. Let's see the audience. Man, Oxymoron killing it by not actually being here. 25%. Damn. That's what we call in the ballpark. Have none of you guys dressed up your dogs? No. Really? I've never, oh, like, Retired. the most I've ever done is, like, give them, like, a festive yes. collar. Yeah. You know? well, I, I, I'm not sure I count that. I had, like, sweaters and little Halloween here. costumes for ah, my tiny dogs. Uh, that I mean, mine's got a sweater because she's short haired and gets down. chilly, but not a costume. Next up. Breathe it in. All right, Surveillance Pro, what do you have for this? What percentage of people prefer using iPhones over Android phones? How many people are idiots? <laughs> Boom. What do you think, Cupid Stunt? <laughs> Bold answer. <laughs> this crowd, maybe. Huh? Oh, I like I like Cupid Stunt style. Let's swing okay. it real hard Fire and alert. fuck with people while they're voting. Oh wait, I think I did Yeah, I, I I was I am yeah. this far from going way higher. And what did the audience say? Oh, oh yeah, oh, and that lower too. I was like, oh shit, I, I thought it was the other way around. Oh well. I'm surprised. Then Dude. again, our audience is smart. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Let's see who got it right. Also, nice. iPhones oh, are stupid, overpriced pieces of garbage. They kind of are. <laughs> Who's next? High five. All right, big giant okay, head. Hey, computer, what do you have for this? I agree one? with the person in the chat. It'd be cool if it just analyzed our phones for this one and we didn't get to vote. <laughs> What percentage of people usually request no ice in their water or soft drinks at restaurants? Ooh. I never trust people who Wait, do that. Wait, water? Yes. Soft drink? What? Soft drink, it means you get more drink. Yeah, I mean, like, yeah. Like, I worked at a movie theater. A lot of people actually do that. It's like, hey, can I get this? No ice? Because you're taught to, like, fill that fucker with ice. So that you give them as little of your resources as possible. Which is so crazy, because soda from a machine costs, like, nothing. I know. The fact that they're like nickel and diming you even more on this nickel and diming drink. Hmm. God, that's hard. People are thinking it's low. Oh, oxymorons here. Welcome back. Think? Welcome back, oxymoron. Ah, yes! damn it! I'm really Ooh. bad at figuring this out. I was on the Ooh, cuff that last time. Hey, man. Well, I got it might just be safe just from being exactly right. I don't right. think I am anymore. Yep, I mean, we are just catching up to you. Yeah. Next up. Yep. All right, Thanks Grant. The I'm lead. pretty sure this is how you develop a fetish. What percentage of people have stuffed animals at home that they've had since childhood? Ooh. Ooh. I'm gonna say a third of you guys are thirty percent. Yeah. Everyone else, roughly a third, lower. rather a little bit less. Are I'm, gonna, I'm gonna say more. I'm gonna say more people hold on to their stuff, and I do count like my mother's house kind of thing, you know. Like I, I still have it. I have one. Running out of time. High five. Everyone says higher except for one of you. Let's see the audience answer. Woo! 69%. Woo! Shit! You weren't within 30%, so no points for you. Sorry, Grant. Let's see who got it right. Whatever. I didn't realize you guys yeah. were all babies. Points. <laughs> and what have we here? Good job. I gave my childhood stuffed animal to my little nephew when he was born. There you go. I gave one to uh, okay, a who's friend of the family's next? child. 
Foolish humans. Foolish humans. All right, buckle in. I've got one for you. General Kenobi. Gift card. That's always what I thought too. Monster Cardle. What percentage of people would rather receive gift cards from iTunes than from Amazon.com? Ugh. Why? Oh, I'm fucking sorry. Is this another one of those, like, Android iPhone? Oh, I, I didn't okay. even realize the hooded teddy uh, was up in this one. He uh, draws a lot of dope fan art for us. Oh, yo, nice. bro! All right, chat, we're counting on you. I mean, I use oh, iTunes God. still, and I would not I've never want a used card. iTunes. The vote is lower. Yo. How did the audience answer? Never. Yup. Six percent. I wasn't bold enough to go much lower. Same. That's a respectable guess. Who got it right? Well done. Oh, you did more points. oxymoron. So sad. Maybe a little more oxy. Look at us, moron. Next up. I'm kidding, I love you. Hello, hello, Ooh, TFS! This is gonna be good. Hi! Ooh. Nasty notes, alright. What percentage of people have left scathing notes on strangers' cars because of poor parking jobs or other vehicular offenses? Actually leaving a note. Bad parking, as someone who parks terribly, I think that's going a little far, but it's like they, like, you know made damage then yes like i think that's perfectly i mean it depends on how bad the parking yeah. is like if you're angled but still you're in the fine. lines then i say is, you're fine which is my rule my rule yeah. is always I'm, yeah. if i'm pick, if i'm touching lower. one line sure if i'm over it i need to fix it breathe it in Ooh. high five also i'm just gonna say lower because i'm Eric King W with the 1500 for Kaiser because fuck the overpriced bullshit that is the iPhone. You know it. Damn. Yes! Ooh. I was curious. I thought maybe. I was really close. I almost put much lower, but I was like, ah. Let's see who got it right. Here's some points. Who did Teddy? I carry a pen. Wow. What should I search for in the old surveillance? Because yeah, that's the other thing. Ooh, I don't think I, I have a means to leave an angry note in my car. I'd have to purchase. Write it, it in your back. blood, Grant. That's why I carry a knife. What percentage of people Summon admit circles. feeling obligated to like Oh no 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 no! Just posts. take it. Yeah no, use the knife. Oh, and then... feeling obligated to liking their friends' posts. Then again, like I don't know how many people treat Facebook like it's that necessary these days. Yeah. I guess it just 60%. depends on how connected you are. I don't are. feel obligated to like, like every post, but if it's like, hey, I got out of the hospital. Yeah. I, I got married. I feel like an asshole if I don't like that one. I don't think it's. An I don't think our audience uses Facebook that much. Facebook? What am I? Thirty? Oh wow! Woo! Okay. Woo. Bam! I was going to say, we get lots of traction on Facebook, but I don't know that that's the same audience that's watching us on yeah, Twitch. Yeah, the only time you should feel obligated to like something on Facebook is when Team Four Star makes a post! <laughs> hey! Got it. Smash that like button! Uh-oh. Lockdown round. says, I'm 18. Oh, and I don't use Facebook. So we could know how they would answer this question. Yeah, but they're actually 14 in Japan. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> subjectivity. All right, let's get uh -oh. a fight going. Oh, boy. You'll okay, that's a pretty theater, theater, huh? list. Good luck. And if you're in the audience, uh, your answers determine who gets The points. third one is the one I'm going to have trouble with. With this audience. Yeah. Oh, shit, you're right. It's this audience. Yep. Fuck. It was easy. It was Fuck. easy. It's not that easy. The fuck are these Don't choices? The these are literally some advantage. of the funniest shows on television. And or were. And or were. And then there's the if rest of the If it wasn't this audience, that would change. development was pretty I've got, I'm just trolling. Yeah. <laughs> I've never seen it, but I know. I've actually doing. never seen Friends. Let's see what answers you chose. Dude. Same. Yeah. I feel like this audience is going to be too, uh, too hipster to be The Simpsons, because they grew up in the shitty seasons. Oh, man. Well, maybe not. Whoa. Oh, man. I, I didn't get any of them. Wow. Oh, man. Whose line? Really? really? I mean, I like it, it but It was okay. Still. Yeah. Wow. Well, I mean, 
are Every game are our audience winner, is super hipsters who watch the good British version and not the shitty American one? Actually, no. To be fair, I don't Damn know. Damn it! The British one. Go for it, Cupid was stunt. Decent, you did it. It was woo. fucking way did. better than Oxymoron. that. Drew Carey nonsense. Oxymoron. I don't play for like three I, rounds. I, I, I mean, it was good. I liked it. <laughs> I, just, I didn't think it was all that much better. Well, that was some good shit. <laughs> and thank you all for joining us for the premiere of DBZA episode fifty nine. The and, hard sell. Yeah, the hard sell. And of course, Ooh. for jacking off with us jerk offs here on Jackbox Jack Off. It's been a great time. We hope you have a wonderful weekend. And we may or may not see you on Monday, but we will definitely see you on Tuesday. Have a good night, everybody. Mwah. <laughs>